I love using wonder clips, but every time I have to collect them from the floor and all corners of the room. So today I decided to sew a clip wrist holder. For this purpose I will use a leather piece from an old bag. I will cut a piece that is 5 cm wide. If you make it with fabric, use thicker fabric and the stabilizer. I found out the length of the piece later because I don't use a pattern, but I will tell you now, the piece is 33 cm long. Take a piece of scrap fabric and cut two strips. Each of them should be around 2 cm wide. You can cut them wider to make them easier to sew. The length of the strips should be the same size as the leather piece or a little bit longer. Lay the strip on top of the leather piece and sew about 4-5 mm from the end. Both pieces must be facing each other. Then sew the second strip. Turn the leather piece over and fold the end of the fabric strip towards the back. Use clips to secure the fabric to the leather piece. Sew carefully and make sure it is even. The back side doesn't turn out very well because the strips were not wide enough, but it will not be visible so we can continue. Now fold the fabric on the other side and sew it the same way. the edges to align them.
Now you can see that the piece is 33 centimeters long. Fold the piece in half and sew it about 2 centimeters from the end. Now take the end, fold it again and sew it the same way. Grab the longer end, fold it and sew it. Now the ends must be the same length as in the beginning. I will fold each side one more time to make a total of 5 folds. In the end, it should look like this. Notice that the ends are the same length. Take a white elastic band and place it in the middle of the first strap. Fold the end of the leather piece inwards and flip the elastic band again. It should look like this. This may not be the best way to sew it, but it should do the job. Clip it securely with a few under clips. And now let's clip the elastic band to the other side. Then I will measure it and tell you how long it is. I put my hand inside and wrap it with the elastic band. To make it the same as on the other side, I will have to cut the elastic band to the first seam. Fold the elastic band, secure it using clips and put it on for a test fit. Place enough clips so that it doesn't move while you try it on. Perfect! This is the exact length I needed. Carefully remove the clips and remove the elastic band. it on the fold. For my hand I need 18 cm long piece of elastic band, but you must check for yourself. 
Now fold it in the same way and sew it. I will make two seams to be more durable. The other side is a little tricky to sew. Put the elastic band in the same way and fold it. Place it under the presser foot. Carefully lower the needle and then pull the middle of the elastic band. Be careful because you can sew over it. Repeat the same for the second seam. This is how it turned out. And this is the pink cushion I made a few years ago. I keep the big wonder clips on a strap from an old bag and they are hanging on the desk lamp, but I don't use them often. That's all for today. See you in my next video. And don't forget to be happy.